varmış. Bir yokmuş. Bir varmış. Bir yokmuş. So one day Nasrettin is walking on the road. He's feeling really good and he sees a well. Get close to the well, look inside. And what does he see at the bottom of the well? The moon. The full moon has fallen down the well. He's looking at it. Oh, wow, now think about it. If the moon has fallen down the well, well, what will the poets write about? What will the lovers look up to in beautiful nights? Oh, who will light the way to the lost travelers? The moon has fallen down the well and Imiti is thinking, I have to do something about it. So he finds a rope, he finds a hook, he brings the rope down to the well, sort of moves it around the water until the hook catches and then ah, the hook catches onto a rock. And he's like, I've got the moon. So he's like, hold on moon, I'm gonna get you out of that well. And he's pulling and pulling and pulling. And it's really hard because the, the hook is well fastened onto the rock. So he's pulling and pulling and pulling. And then finally, all of a sudden, the, the hook gives way. And so he goes, Faw! and he falls on his back all the way down and looking up. What does he see? The full moon has flown right out of the well, back into the sky. And he goes, all right. I'm just glad I could be of help. And I, I love that story also for many reasons, but one of them is that I've lived 14 years in Turkey and I've seen that this happens very often. That in Turkey, when you have something that falls or something that breaks, People on the street will just stop and say, what can I do about it? It's something that I think is very typical here. I've seen people with their cars totally blocked and people just lifting the car and putting it back onto the road in minutes. And I think there's really this attitude, the first attitude that Nasatin is saying, what if it takes? It's a lot of attitude about, let's try this and see if it works. Maybe it will, no one has done it before, but maybe it will. And, and the other is that there's a real attitude of saying, hey, someone needs help. What can I do? And just doing it because we're just glad we could be of help. So, so I think this reflects both the, the kindness of the children and the attitude that I've often seen in this country. So that's the story I wanted to share with you today. Thank you.